In this lecture, I am going to load total comments count for each block in Node.js and I will add comment counter short functionalities to our GetBlocks API endpoint. Our GetBlocks API endpoint is calling block controllers list method. And to load total comments count for each block, I will modify this project object. I will provide another key inside this project object called comments underscore count and then I will provide an object and inside this object I will provide dollar size and you need to provide a field of type array as a value if you remember we stored comments id for each block inside this block underscore comments array so I will provide this block underscore comments field here now if I execute our getbox api endpoint from postman you see we are getting an error the argument to size must be an array because some of our blocks don't have this block underscore comments array so I'll add a condition here so I'll provide an object and inside this object I'll add if null that means if a block don't have this block underscore comments array then this will count the data from this blank array and if a block has comments then this will count the data from this block underscore comments array field now if I execute our get blocks API endpoint again you see now we have comments count for each block so I'm going to add this comments count field for block details endpoint block data so I'll add this lines of code in the project object which is inside our details method so let's modify the details method so I'll add this lines of code here and now if I execute our block details endpoint you see we have this comments count for our block details endpoint 2 okay now I'm going to add this to our create method and inside our update method because I'm going to make the structure similar to our gate blocks and block details endpoint so I'll provide this inside this project object and I'll also modify this inside our update method now let's check our comment count to i short functionality is working or not so let's uh, let's call our get blocks api endpoint with short by field comments underscore count and short order descending now this should return the block which has most comments in the first position you see we are getting the blocks which has most uh, most comments in the first position now let's change it to ascending now this will return the blocks which has least comment in the first position so our comments count or short function is working properly because now we have comment count field for each block and during get blocks api endpoint i provided this short by field and short order dynamically to our short object you can watch our getbox api endpoint which is included in this series in the next lecture i'm going to add like and remove like functionality for a block so stay connected